What's up guys, Pokemon here. Today we'll be probably be opening up our last Temporal Forces booster box. The last booster box we got was really lucky. We got a gold card and an SAR. Um, sadly, the gold card and the SAR were the lower ones I wanted. Um, they, were, they were at the very bottom actually. <laughs> but uh, nonetheless, that's very lucky and very good. Um, our first ever booster box of Temporal Forces, we didn't get any. So I should not be complaining. That was very lucky and I'm very happy that we got the, the double banger booster box. Um, this will probably be my last booster box for a, a while, maybe. Um, if we get lucky here, but we get unlucky, like let's say we get an SAR, but it's not the one I wanted, I might open another one since my luck is still going, right? We gotta keep it going. Um, but yeah, Temporal Force booster box, maybe our last one for a while. Let's just start ripping. All right, well, here's the booster box. Uh, I've opened three of these now on the, on the channel. Um, you probably have seen this before already. And uh, yeah, our last booster box was really lucky. Um, we got a gold card and an SAR. That is really lucky. Um, like I said, you're not even guaranteed one. So getting both in one box is pretty nice. Um, but here, here's you know the normal booster box. We've opened this, like I said, multiple times. Um, let's start with the right side this time. Let's switch it up a little bit. Never start on the right side, but first pack. Let's see if we can start off with the first pack magic. Um, yeah, uh, we're... Really, really, the only things in this set that I really want are the il special illustration rares um, or the gold cards. So, the, all the smaller cards like the illustration rares, the full arts, and stuff like that, we're pretty good with, honestly. So, we're, this is kind of, I mean, a waste of money if you think about it, since I really only want like two cards. Um, I, they are expensive though. The Iron Crown is around a hundred dollars, sadly. Um, when, if, when the, this set came out, that card was like $50. Would I ever think that card would shoot up to 100 Heck no, dude. <laughs> um, every other set in Scarlet and Violet, all the cards have been did drop like 40 to 60%. So it was just so surprising to see that card just jump up so much. Um, not too surprising, but like kind of surprising that it jumped up that much. At one point, this card was $250, which is insane. Um, but yeah, uh... I, I, I'm pretty sure that card will drop, though. It probably will maybe be like a $70 card eventually. Um, but not right now. Not right now. So uh, I won't FOMO. I won't buy the cards right now. Uh, but I, I will keep on opening packs a little bit. And our first essay, uh, illustration rare. Oh, and it's the extra drill. Okay. This is the, probably my favorite other than the Ghastly. It's so cool. He's chilling with the bros on lunch break. I pulled this, I pulled this one in Japanese. But I'll definitely take it in English. Yeah, that's such a good one. I like that one a lot. And no double banger there. Um, but oh, probably my top three favorite special illustration or illustration rare from this sense. Really happy to pull this. Starting off really strong. Really happy with that pull. Um, yeah, that might this might be my last box for sure. After if we get like really lucky and pull like a non dupes, that'd be really nice. Um, even if we don't get an illustration or a special illustration or a gold card, this might be my last one for a while. Um, I say that, but I mean, I don't know. <laughs> Licky Licky, Batang, Charcoal, Grotto, Latias. Really nice Latias card. Rock Rough, Meltan, Maridon, regular, regular hollow. Let's keep it going. Next pack, Temporal Forces, come on. This will probably be like 140-ish, 150-ish packs of this set that I've opened. Um, we pulled two SARs and one gold card. That's actually not too bad, but obviously compared to like, let's say, Crown and regular EX. Give me, if you're gonna give me an EX, give me an Iron Crown. Or the, the Verzian. <laughs> um, so three top rarity cards that have around 150 packs, you know, compared to, let's say, Poly Evolved. Um, you would have gotten 6 in 96 packs to 108 packs, <laughs> which is insane. Um, so this is very, very different compared to the beginning of Scarlet and Violet. Um, though I will say, getting two SARs in one box was fun. Um, I can see why people wanted it to be less. Uh, I really liked the one per box, whether it was a gold or an SAR. I didn't mind that. Um, but now we are not guaranteed one. Um... Obviously, it makes pack opening a little less, especially booster boxes, a little less enjoyable to some people. Because um, you spend, like, let's say retail, $160, and <laughs> you just don't get a big pool. 
that that doesn't feel too good, right? So, um, but a lot of people are really happy about this, especially collectors or not collectors. Um, you know the the people that try to flip cards and stuff like that for value, which you know there's nothing wrong with that. Um, yeah, but to me, I think w the either a gold card or an SAR per booster box wasn't too bad. I, I did not mind that because it made opening booster boxes worth it. You know, like a hundred percent worth it, right? Um, sure, the the ETBs and stuff like that, you might not get anything. That's but if you open up a booster box, you're like, oh, okay, well, at least I know I will get something, right? Um, I'm just kind of regular hollow, though it isn't too bad, like I said. Um, not as bad as alt arts, not as bad as Sun and Moon era. This is still not that bad. Uh, essentially, after getting like 15 hits in a box, yeah, I mean, you really can't complain too much, um, but you know, that's just how it is. But next pack, Meryl, Grottle, Dunsparce. Snom. I don't know if I fooled that illustration rare. Airy full art would be nice. Come on. Oh, Ragey Bolt full art. Yes. Okay. Nice. Uh, yeah, I think this will be my last box if we keep on getting this lucky. Um, now we just need to SAR. Um, but the one full art that I wanted, other than the ones I already have, um, we're getting pretty lucky. I guess the only S the full art that I got that I did not really want was the Scizor, which, like I said, Scizor is one of my favorite Pokemons, but I had that card in Japanese. I would have loved to have gotten a different one, obviously. But we're, we're this box starting off pretty strong. Let's see if we can keep it going. Hopefully we can end it off with one SAR or a gold card in this box. Hopefully my luck wasn't just in that last box. But come on, Miss Energy, Sandy Shocks. All right, Valiant, Solosis. Main regular hollow that looked that looked too sparkly on camera. Not gonna lie. Next pack, I was kind of like, What? <laughs> Next pack, come on. Hopefully, we can get Bianca full art. Um, oh, that's go card. Um, uh, the regular full art. I mean, sure, I would love the SAR, but the regular full art would be nice. The airy regular full art would be nice. Um, Buddy Poffin, Iron Treads, Deerling, Chatot, and Rory Moon regular, regular hollow. Um, but yeah, um, that new set, Crimson Haze, I opened up one box and it was pretty good. I, I ordered two more. Um, I think I'll be opening up only those two. I won't order, open up six like the last time I opened up Cyber Judge and, uh, what is it, Wild Force, which is the Japanese version of this set. Um, yeah. And I believe there's, oh, Walking Wake regular X. Give me Iron Crown, come on. <laughs> You're gonna give me X, like I said, give me Iron Crown. Um, but yeah, uh, I believe there's another, there's like two, or one more Japanese set that's coming out soon. Um, obviously not one more, but like, I mean, this is another one. And it should be more cars that are going to be in Tempor, uh, not Tempor Forces. What's the next set? I know, it's crazy. We're opening up Tempor Forces, but the next set was already announced and for pre-order. Uh, Twilight Masquerade, I believe. Um, there should be two to three Japanese sets in that one box. Um, so all the cards in Crimson Haze is like probably only half or maybe even one third just like um, Paradox Rift. I'm, I'm, not, I'm not sure. They might be only the two new sets that are coming out um, But yeah, uh, I, I've seen people complain about the set being too gen 9 focused um, I mean At the end of the day, you don't have to open up these products, you know um, If you don't like gen 9, then just skip the set. Nothing wrong with it. Um, the Dunsparce, regular holo. Uh, yeah, though, I will say that uh, in this Temper Force is kind of clutched because sure, they're not, they're not old generation Pokemon, but they're, they are, but they aren't. So it's kind of a cool way to keep the nostalgic in there, but also make it new. Um, but apparently this new set has a bunch of new generation 9 Pokemon that is just like, no, apparently the, you know, Obviously, the older people don't care about, which makes sense, right? Um, but obviously, these sets are for kids. You know, <laughs> so they don't care, right? Um, but next pack. Um, but uh, yeah, I, that Twilight Masquerade. If they, if that second set that comes out in Japanese, that's gonna probably be in Twilight Masquerade. Um, you know, it just doesn't have cards that I don't want, and I might only open up one booster box. The reason why I open up three of this set is because I really like it, right? I don't care if the Pokemon are, you know, newer or whatever. Um, if just look really good, they look really good. You know, I think this scent, pretty much every SAR, except for maybe one, is fantastic. Literally, I would, you know, um, if I didn't pull Iron Boulder twice in Japanese, I would have freaking loved that pulling that card in the last video. Um, like I said, I pulled that card three times, which, 
Yeah, it kind of sucks, but you know, there it is. The Rabombi, Hontor, and Karina. We're going on a, on a dry streak right now. Come on. Last pank of the right side already. Holy, that was fast. We only got four hits. Two EXs, one is illustration rare, one pull art. This right side was really empty. The left side is about to pop off. Uh, it has to. <laughs> Cutie fly. That's my girl. Colossal. Order. Yamper. Oh. Oh, please don't tell me there was a full art. No, there wasn't. It was just a, an iron leaves, which I guess it isn't too bad of a card, but um, still no iron crown. If we're going to give me an EX, give me an iron crown. Though that one is probably like the, the second best one you want, I guess. Uh, haven't pulled that in a little bit. Um, but starting off on the left side. Right side's empty. Left side, let's see. Um, this right side should, or left side should be pretty stacked. We only have like five hits. We should get at least like eight more, hopefully. Come on. But I don't care about that. Let's see if we can pull an SIR or a gold card. Would be really nice if we can pull at least one more. Would kind of end this um, booster box opening. Really nice. I probably won't have any point of opening another booster box if we do pull one more. That'd be really, really nice. But come on, next pack. Let's see. If we can pull one. Look at Tongue, which I don't have the illustration here for that card yet. I have that card in Japanese, so but I would love that card in English. Rapska, Fortress, Tranquil, Skitty. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Iron Crown regular EX. Alright. Like I said, if you're gonna give me a regular EX, give me Iron Crown. Okay. Um I, you know, obviously whenever that card drops below two dollars, that ooh isn't gonna be there anymore. But for right now that card's for some reason ten dollars. <laughs> so it's it's you know, some cards that have really high value is cool. Though I like I said I do think the future EXs are really nice. The ancient ones are okay. Um Oh, getting a phone call. I always get phone calls while I record. Metagross, giraffe, Pikachu, Iron Thorns, regular, regular EX. Come on, next pack. Iron Crown on the on the front. I need that SAR. Come on. Come on. Iron Crown, Bianca, or Morty. Like I said, that Morty grew on me. Um, Walking Wake is really nice. Um, but yes, Iron Crown. Or the Verizian. The Iron Leaves is really nice. Totodile. Cutie Fly and Macargo, regular. Regular holo. Come on, next pack. This pack feels freaking heavy. We're kind of zooming. I feel like, yeah, I feel like all the hits are in the back. They should be. All the, we're, it's, it's really fast. This opening's been really fast. Uh, these hits have been really spread apart. Keldeo, Shroomish, Lycanroc, and uh, I'm right on regular. Holla, come on. Oh, don't end this, don't end this Temporal Forces booster box with this trash. You gotta get something. Next pack, come on, please. Azalea, Cutie Fly, Drover, Relor, that's my girl, Vicavolt, Great Tusk, the Dunsparce, Charge a Bug. Oof. Oh, come on. <laughs> Next pack. Oof. I know, I know. This, 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 this just means that all the all the hits are at the very end. There's gonna be a lot of last pack magic, hopefully. <laughs> Chat tots. Kani, oh, I don't know, Carvana, Ekans, Anchor, Electivire, Tintino, Ekans, Iron Valiant, and, oh, our first time pulling Salvatore. No Bianca regular full arts, no Airy regular full arts. Salvatore, I guess I'll take it. Uh, I don't have it. I'll take it. Um, obviously, I want the waifus, uh, the waifu cards. I'd rather have Airy or Bianca any day. Um, my next pack, but like I said, a card that I don't have, um, not gonna lie, this box has been pretty, pretty okay. I mean, the, at the beginning it was pretty good, but uh, obviously the, these next few packs should be full of hits. Exadrill, Morty, Heat more. Roaring Moon, regular, regular hollow. There's about 10 to 12 packs left. Come on. Come on. Please, don't fail me now. Turtwig, Poochie, and a staring at the moon. Wiglet, Arbok. Capsule, Great Tusk. Delcaddy, Knockdown. Shriftree. 
This is a regular EX, okay. <laughs> I don't know, I thought it was a full air for a sec, but it wasn't. Ah, come on. That should be our last EX, maybe? We have, what, about five, maybe? We might get one more, though, sadly. <laughs> sadly. Um, we already pulled the Iron Crown, so I need... Oh, our Ace Spec cards, where are they? That's why this box, box feels mid. We're missing a lot of our hits. Should be all at the end. Screamtail. Zero really, really nice common arts. Raichu. Crocona, Drampa, regular, regular holo. This box, like I said, pretty bad start. Maybe, maybe the left side really is just that OP every time. <laughs> this is the first time I ever started on the right side, and it's so bad. Um, but C dots, Totodow, Deerling, Pidove. There's the guy. Iron Hands, Morty, Golet. Look, what is this? Oh, Mincino, okay, we, I don't think we pulled this one. This is the other half, Cincino, which we pulled in the last video. No double banger, so I'll definitely take it. Okay, another new illustration rare. I'm pretty sure I don't have this one. Nice. I might have pulled that in Japanese though, but not in English. Any, I don't think recently. So I'll definitely take that. Not bad. I think two out of the three illustration rares have been brand new. That's really nice in this box. This box has been pretty good. Not nothing too crazy yet, but pretty solid. Um, pretty lucky so far with no not a lot of dupes. Totodow, Deerling, Sharpedo, Metagross, Roserade, Turtonator. Ah, come on, come on. I feel it coming though. These last few packs should be stacked. I hope. I hope. I mean, <laughs> I hope. But come on. Pineco, Malwell, Meditite, Terminator, Shrift Tree. Oh, there she is. Snum, C dots. Oof, Flutter Main, regular hollow. There is about five packs left. Come on. Please don't fail me now. Is there, like I said, if there's still packs on the table. There's always a chance. And that looks good. Or no, no, okay, that doesn't look too good. It's, it's just, uh, I had to look again, because the color... Ah, no Prime Catcher still! I pulled this one four times! Ah, come on, Prime Catcher. We still have one more chance to get one more respect. But that's probably the weakest one that you want. No Prime Catcher yet. That Prime Catcher will make this box... Make or break this box. 100, unless we pull an, an SAI. But come on. Oh, come on, stupid thing got stuck. Um, oh, get that out of there. All right, all right. Heat more. The Emperor, Tora Cat, Grubbin, Screamtail, Baton, Valorant, Vineco, Mime, and oh, crying on regular Hollow. <sighs> Maybe I'm tripping. Maybe we are pretty much done. Like I said, we should get one more illustration here. Uh. Hopefully we do. The last three packs, I believe. Yeah. Coming to the end. Oh no, this is not looking too good. These three packs should have something in it, though. Each one should have at least something. Um, one A-spec, one illustration rare, and maybe one special illustration rare. Hopefully. <laughs> Hopefully. <laughs> I'm praying that there is one more big hit. But man, well. Meditite. Keldeo. Iron Jugulus. Anchor. Nuzleaf. Alert. Oh no, maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe we're not gonna get one. It's looking more likely that we're not gonna get an il special illustration rare because these two last two packs should have one illustration rare and one ace spec. Unless we get a double banger, which I guess is not impossible, but very, very, very unlikely. Beldum, Brillum, Roly Coley, Lycanroc, Salvatore, Palafin, Azumaru. Oh my gosh, wait, we might not even get. Wait, this might have been one of the worst boxes that we've ever opened. Oh my gosh, I should have saved this. This was really bad luck. Last pack. Holy, this might have been the worst box. Wow, this set is very inconsistent. This is terrible. Is there an ace pack in this? Wow, we didn't get two ace packs. And of course, we got to the worst ace pack we could have pulled. The last pack. Cincino, Sableye, Roly Coley. What? This was the worst? Booster box that I've ever opened in Scarlet and Violet. What the heck? Is that really the last pack? Yeah. 
Holy, what? I should have kept that sealed 100%. That was a, like, that was throwing away money. Like, and I mean throwing away money. Holy guacamole. One, two. I mean, I guess this is fine. Six, which is pretty much normal in a box. Six EXs. Though we did get an Iron Crown, which is pretty nice, but only two illustration rares. Which, I don't have both of them, so I'm, I'm really happy about that. I got two really nice ones, but one A spec. One A spec and only two illustration rares, which, like I said, I know it's about 2.79% chance of getting uh, illustration rares in a box, but only. What? what? <laughs> That was, that was really bad. That was really, really bad. Though I will say that we didn't dupe too many times. Just we got a lack of hits. So that was one, two, three, four, five, five plus. We got 11 hits. 11. There's no way. Wait, what? There's no way. Hold on. Oh yeah, I didn't, <laughs> I didn't find any extra packs anywhere. Um, yeah, wow. I, I think that's probably the one of the most unlucky boxes we've ever could have gotten. 11 hits. We missed both. We missed on getting two A specs and getting three illustration rares. So that would have been 13. Um, that was probably the most unlucky box that you could have ever get from this set. Um, yeah, I mean, and sadly, we still haven't gotten the Prime Catcher. And... I mean, we didn't get a special illustration or a gold card. I guess that's just how it is. Um, our first ever, or no, no, let me flip the camera and just very real quick. Yeah, so there it is. Temporal Forces is very brutal. This just made me realize that this set is, I, I guess if you ever get that lucky and pull an SAR and a gold card, pr probably don't open up another booster box because, wow. I mean, our, our first ever booster box of Temporal Forces was pretty decent. I think we got 14 hits. No SAR or gold card, but 40 hits, you know, whatever. Um, the next booster box I opened, we got 15 hits. We got a gold card and an SAR, which is really lucky. And our third booster box, we only got 11. That 11 hits is insane. Uh, I, I swear we're missing packs, but we're not. We missed out on getting two, three, or two ace packs and three uh, illustration rares, which would have been 13. Um, Wow, <laughs> that was crazy. To be fair, I did get some nice cards that I didn't have, like the, the Raging Bolt floor is nice. Um, the Exadrill illustration was really good. The Sinchino, or Minchino, that I also don't have. Um, but we just didn't get enough. I feel like that was a terrible box. Yeah, watch out for Temporal Forces. I, I don't know. I guess just sometimes, it, this set is just, really inconsistent you can get really freaking lucky or you can get nothing and i that was pretty much nothing um not gonna lie um but yeah there's the video like subscribe comment share um yeah after opening that booster box i think i'm done <laughs> even though we're so early into this set i might not open another but <sighs> iron crown is such a nice color i really want to pull that or the gengar morty or the bianca oh but holy, that was terrible. I got to, I, I got those two boxes at the same time. I got one of the best boxes you could have ever pulled and one of the worst boxes you could have ever pulled. Wow. Temper Forces is such a mixed bag. I see why people aren't enjoying opening this set. That is insane. I, I just, I can't believe it. But yeah, there's a the video. Um... And are you opening up any more Temporal Forces? Um, I think I probably am good. <laughs> I think I am good. Um, but yeah, there's the video. Wow, I, I, I'm i just in shock how bad that was. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what to, I don't know. I don't even know what to, to think about that box. The box was terrible. Um, I have not seen anyone open up a box that bad. Maybe I just never paid attention. To, you know, I, I've seen some bad openings, but that was terrible. Um, yeah, there's the video. I guess the last two videos that I uploaded, which was the really OP box and then this box, you can just see if you want to take that risk of getting a really nice box or getting a really bad box. There it is. I'm just, 
I'm just rambling now of how bad that was. Um, yeah, there's the video. What's Patrick again? Goodbye.